Bonjour, hi, welcome to Beyond My Cloud. I'm Frank Boucher, your host for the next two hours. We'll have fun. There are some people already in there. So we have Surdy Dev. Hello, hello, hello. And uh, hopefully more cloudies will, uh, will join us. We're just chatting before we start the stream. And uh, the week was great. Excellent. I've been working on migration some class library .NET standard and yesterday it all worked oh this is you know <laughs> yes i understand that i've been fighting with stuff at work and when everything will be working oh what a delight it will be and lending already excellent excellent you get package return uh, result what what i don't want to i don't want to merge your pull request <laughs> 121,000 lines added. Oh my God. Let's start the stream with this comment. Start and we'll say today we'll be working on the 2D6 dungeon app. Just like this. So now CB is aware of her stuff. You can play the game if you're watching live, obviously, by doing exclamation point drops. If you don't know all the commands, you could do exclamation point CMD for command or CMDS. And, uh, oh, 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 ah, oh, no, like far away. And yeah, so we are Friday. It's the morning. I don't know. Today, I feel like I'm having trouble getting started, though. My watch told me. I slept. I slept well, so I don't know why I'm, I'm slow, but I am. So hopefully, hopefully I don't bore you too much. No, I think today will be cool. So um, a little bit of uh, show and tell. So if I go with Dev T O. Yeah. Here, we'll share my screen in three seconds. Uh, boom! I wrote, I shared this. So I, I, I was working. Uh, I'm, I'm working with like biceps files. So biceps are infrastructure, infrastructure as code A, A C, uh, file where you describe all your architecture and then deploy that in the cloud in Azure in my case. And while it's deploying, if it's a big solution, then you have kind of time and I didn't like I have multiple projects to kind of refresh the biceps so like it's it's a long week so I don't I didn't want to context switch too much so on the last stream we were having fun uh removing password uh from inside docker file so uh so I wrote a, a blog post so we'll put that in the chat kind of uh Share that if you want. It's I don't think it's uh, oh and also I I had the segment though I don't know why maybe uh, if someone know in the chat let me know but um, I didn't know how in uh, Dev two because Dev two like uh, you're using like curly brackets and percentage like some and then you say YouTube in the key and then it kind of like generate that frame. On my personal blog, because I also posted on my my blog, I use iframe, right? So if you click, you start. Oh, you don't. Uh, developers need. Interesting. Or was it because I moved it? Oh, oh. That's not. Oh, I dropped some coffee in my keyboard and the, there's stain beside the keys uh, if i do this and i open that here let's see if it was just because it remembers if i do this drop the keynote uh, developers need to deeply integrate security into every part of the development life cycle okay it's mostly so what i'd like to do now is invite developers cannot so they in, in my blog post i added this segment of julia and john from Microsoft during uh, build, uh, yeah, build day two keynote because they talk about security. And since the blog was about security and and kind of a lot, you know, I used to do that a lot. 
and like where I, I hard code my password because I was like, eh, it's not important. It's not that important. It's just a demo. Um, but then hackers are really targeting that to learn your pattern and stuff like that. So uh, I feel now, nope, I don't want any password anymore. So that's why I decided to do that. And that's why I shared that you should do it. Of course, when you're doing production, you should use secret. I think I say it the, the intro like, yeah, use secret. It's better. But secret required a little bit more effort. And I'm like, yeah, you know what? Like, at least do do it with the environment variable. Yes, the password will be visible in the logs. But if you're just learning, testing, doing a proof of concept, it's totally fine. You will be able to kind of follow uh, what happened. So I think I think it's it's okay. And, and like when you go in production, switching to secret won't be that big of a deal because you could just say it's a, looking in the environment, look in the secret file, and that's it. But I thought at least there's no secret that you're pushing in your repository. So that was that was the thing. I didn't, did I drop? I don't think I, do, I dropped. I, I think I start typing. Last week, I changed my chroma key. And now it's all... I won't say it. But it's not great. You know, the F-bomb word. If I do this, it's not great. If I do that, what? Now it's my headphone. This maybe. That seems my hair is not good, but my hair is spiky, so I shouldn't wear hats like Jeff. Previously on Frank's channel. Yeah, Jeff. Love his uh his stream. I I miss this. I miss like he. Like he's doing a series on Aspire, and I miss the one he did this week. Glasses are not okay. Well, that's, that looks okay. I'm not looking to be perfect. You do with what you have, right? <laughs> cool. Okay. So yeah, so the... Oops. I was trying to switch screen, and I couldn't because it's a different computer. Do you have to keep you? Oh, <laughs> I wish I had like a <laughs> sound. It's a good one. My chroma key. No, last, last week I didn't have a uh, AC. Uh, so it was super hot. I think it was like something like 27, 30 degrees Celsius in my office. So I kind of like turned down, turn off. I think I kept one light just to kind of like help a little bit with the background. So, because even if I'm using LED, it's still more warm and stuff. And I think I closed the door because I had some people doing a lot of noise upstairs. So it was just getting warmer and warmer and warmer. I have a new machine. And since I'm in the basement, I need a little OD. I'm wearing socks <laughs> because it's cold, but like, not cold, but you know, like if you're not moving and sitting, that's why like when I'm streaming most of the time, I'm like in between because like I move, I'm standing, I have more energy, but when you're sitting, you know, not moving much, I feel like, you know, could be, uh, could be a little bit more chilly. <laughs> oh yeah. I work in the dark, so when the stream is off, I will just like turn it off. It's just like to have a better, like this is my, like you see it, like right, there's like a, a lot of green around my hand and stuff. This is a, a green screen. To have a better green screen, you, you have to put some lights. And I have lights to, you know, could, could make it darker also. Just like that. I work in the dark. Could say, you know what? Even the clouds are dark. Let's do with the rain. And the clouds are turning dark now. Just like that. You have to pee. Now it's your time. 
Okay, enough. Let's go back to our stuff. Let's put some. My walking pad. Oh, I'm not sure I would do that. Like I, I have some color. I need to like it's been a while, so uh like some of my colleagues they had this and I saw them in the meeting and stuff walking. Or well, like most of the time they try to not walk like in big meetings, but when it was just with me sometimes they were with me uh, walking. I don't mind. I know some people don't like really don't like that. I didn't really care. But um I wonder it's been at least one year now. I wonder where is that walking pad? Is it like <laughs> under the couch, under the bed, or is this still under the desk? In a position that they can use. Oh. Okay, so the plan of today. Today we are continuing working on 2D6 dungeon app. It's a dungeon crawler, it's a paper game. <clears throat> My voice is it's a paper game. Uh dice and paper. And I started I reached out to um, Toby, the, the creator of that game, and I asked him, can I create, is it okay if I create a version, a kind of digital companion, not like a full game, because I'm not a game developer, and it's just for me, like it's an excuse to try different technology and learn and have fun. Um, so I'm, I'm building that. Um, and he was like, yeah, sure, do it. So I did that, so now we have and we've been working on that. So if we go in the uh, Behind My Cloud plug website, like last time we removed the art coded password and it was an error. Magic potion was missing in the database. So we fixed that and stuff. So like, this is like, I'm so red. <laughs> the chroma key was all screwed up. So if you are interested for any project, that or maybe you're curious to know what we go so you could go at behindmycloud.com <clears throat> sorry my voice is acting weirdly and, and you could scroll and scroll and scroll or you could go in projects and then you'll have the list of the project we did all the code uh, should be available online there's nothing secret except the secrets or the for example for the url shortener like the code is there but obviously you have another one that I don't share because I'm, I'm using it. But the rest of it is all public all the time. So 2D6 Dungeon, you could click on that project. You have like a short definition, like a screenshot and stuff like that. And after that, you'll have all the streams where we worked on. And it's the same for all the projects. So all the projects are defined here. We have uh, CB also, or CloudBot, CB for CloudBot, because when I say word it sounds like something else uh is it cloud yeah and your friend is just here watching our best score i need to integrate it and put some ai here. i was watching uh code rush stream last week and uh he put some ai in alex and i thought it was fun i thought it was it was funny so uh maybe i will do that but I felt like everybody did it, so <laughs> there's nothing new. But uh, so I need to find a spin on that that could be cool. Okay, so in the game right now, we we are able to. Yay! I landed with a, a fantastic score of four. Even Fragbird could 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 beat me. <laughs> Okay, so yeah, um, Poserus, congrats, 82. You're definitely leading, I think. Uh, I think I'll open this app. Oh, that was loud. So that's the the book, the digital version of the book. And what I want to mimic today, what I want to do is encounter 
when we have encounter where is it or combat where is it inventory herbal combat so like a little bit the way it work but i think what we need is to create some kind of screen some maybe something like that i don't know this is the card so like the game offer cards uh, and that's what it says so you have fatigue that you put there and it will, it will increment you have some shift uh, i think we can put our enemy on the side uh, we'll definitely need some dice so i want to start building that that fight screen that combat screen Give me just two seconds. Sometimes Flipping pages. Why is that working? Sometimes flipping pages is faster than searching a page. Ooh, faster than searching a page. Well, yeah. Combat. This. So we have the quick reference card, and that's there. Roll to it, armor deflection. Oh yeah, we could we could have that. So if we go, it was the page, no page number to the end. far oh, I forgot my paper okay so yeah so I think we could use this so people have some kind of information definitely this in the screen since as you're going into the fight you're getting tired and tired so like this change so we could have something like that it doesn't need to look like that but i want this information and since i'm trying to companion the app maybe i should have that so i have this and and then maybe like a tab with the quick reference with those three and maybe the card of your enemy here and i'm assuming we'll have to have our card some like some kind of info so we know what kind of mana we have and, and stuff okay so that's the plan of today we want to create kind of high level diagram on that uh let's open the kraken because i'm not sure in where are we oh i reached out to uh get kraken uh, support and uh because for for uh wait what is it working they told me it was not fixed it is
It all fits. It's working. Whoops. Close that. Oh, I feel like it's getting warm in here. That's cool. Try and go in your corner. Other corner. Yeah, so now we have Pro version 21. They told me, I was about to, to tell you, like, they told me, like, they didn't fix it. But look, they. I don't know. Like, it looked fixed to me. I'm, I'm scared to click here. Let's do it. So, like, no, see, windows all fit in my screen. I can maximize and see everything. Oh, yay. They they told me, like, uh, it was not done in version 10. They didn't have the time. Version 10 was a lot of changes. So, if you don't know, this is Git Kraken Desktop. It's a Git visual tool to help you uh, to manage your Git repo when you're not sure of the command. Uh, now it helps you with PRs, with code suggestions. This is amazing. When you work in a team, you could make suggestions. Uh, you, you could control your PR all from the same. It also works with uh, very well with CodeLens in VS Code. It's owned by the same company, Git Kraken. And I'm an ambassador of Git Kraken. I love so much their stuff that at some point I say, hey, would you like to be an ambassador? And I say, yes. And now Chris is working for them. So uh, Chris Griffin uh, is a, a uh, an advocate for Git Kraken. And it was very funny because in a meeting um, I joined and here he was and uh, introduced himself and he was just getting started and stuff. So it was pretty cool. Anyway, so uh, they fixed it. Oh, I'm very, uh, I'm so happy because it was annoying. Like I didn't have the, the status bar and everything. So now it's all working. What's that? Activity log. Oh, that's cool. And keyboard shortcut. Oh, I should definitely use that. Support. Love that. Hey. Harvey. RW Harvey. How are you? Welcome aboard. First time in the chat. Welcome, welcome. We're just getting started. I just realized uh, a few, two weeks ago, I think, they get Kraken released their version 10. Now they did the 10 v1. And on that specific environment, I'm on Linux with like an, a narrow screen more wide than, it, than its height. Uh, I couldn't have it full screen and now it worked. So I'm very happy about that. That's pretty cool. I just feel like you can keep my mouse moving. So yeah, that, that might be. That's cool. So I'm gonna let him know. So the two dungeon six. Okay. Here. So Okay, use secrets. I did experiment with that. I don't think I want that. It was too much of a pain. So right now we are adding creature, we fix potion. Why not going back into main? We should. I'm doing great. Just making a character sprite sheet for my game. How about you? Uh, that's great. Uh, we are working today on. 2d6 dungeon app uh it's a dungeon crawler it's a paper and dice game and i'm building a companion app and um so like it's all uh in a book where is the book oops book is here let's go first page boom so it's a book it's there it is so this is the book and uh 
I'm creating like a companion app. So to help less flipping through the book, but still have that feeling. So I don't want like a full automate game. I want some kind of interactivity. And today we'll be working on the uh, combat window. But I think last stream that we work on that, adding content, not fixing content, we, if we look into the code, we are adding creature. So right now we are an add creature. And I think, I think we could merge it back and then open a new one for combat. Thank you. And TBD is rating us. Woo woo woo. Bonjour. Hello, hello. It's party time. Let's drop. Why my mic is so light? Hey, thank you for the. What was that? I landed. Oh, that's cool. But what was the other? Oh, first time in a chat. Welcome, readers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I will say that. <laughs> Sorry, Dev. Know all the stuff. Excellent. And uh, we can also do something like so. I think that's how it works. Yeah. Welcome, welcome, Raiders. Hopefully the the ad is finished. How was your uh, your stream, uh, Mister TBD? <laughs> Asking the same thing. Hot things today. Like it's way cooler today. Even if I'm wearing just a t-shirt, I was wearing a hoodie a little bit earlier. I have the lights turns on. It's feel definitely better. And today we'll be working on the uh, combat screen adding like the structure and like decide what we want to add into the combat stream screen not stream but screen it was good we made some progress on the agile stuff adding some unit test oh i need to do some unit test too in my uh in my things <laughs> procrastinating doing those but for me it was just a proof of concept right now i feel like when i have like the combat screen set up i think then i will start having something where i could even deploy maybe every time or something like that that's what everyone says you're right you're right but for me right now i'm kind of like just experimenting so like it's not the real game that's why it's not you like it's not test I'm not sure on the structure i'm not sure on the tech i'm not sure on anything i'm just kind of like okay how would i do this how would i do that is it possible to do this and once i have it set then i will start like like i said i will probably imp implement a ci cd so it deploys so people could just like have a, a visual a little bit better than that yeah. You think it will be dope? I think too. I just need more time. And I, and today we I was really close today to work on something uh, work related. Work on something work related. Yeah. Um. I need to convert a WPF app into Blazor, and uh, I needed a lot of visuals, like moving hints. Uh. But we want to keep all the logic in C sharp. So I was like, oh, like, how can I do that? Like, should I have give like a bunch of instruction to the end or let the end be <laughs> kind of? So it, it go and do its stuff. And when it hit, I don't know, like, it, like it's, it's walking. And then when it hit like a yellow tile or whatever, like then it needs to know, needs to turn right. I don't know. I don't want that logic to be in JavaScript because like to display the stuff, just like I do in this game, I'm using HTML Canva, but I don't want the logic in JavaScript. I want the logic in C sharp. I was like, oh, should I just like trigger an event? 
so I'm not sure how to do it. And I was like, oh, we could do that. But then I was like, oh, we'll be again like you're just messing around and not making any progress. So that's why I decided, well, you know what? No, let's let's do the stuff and we do this. So that's why we're working on the yeah, app. But I feel like I didn't do my due diligence. And uh, we, so we need to, to move this. So let's start a pull request. Hey, thank you for the follow XYCX. Very, very appreciated. Thank you. Oh, not create a creature. What is this? Because we have four creature. Because I just had some. Uh, I think that will be it. Yeah, we can assign it to me. And definitely advance it. Let's create a pull request. Do programmer write ideas and break them down on paper before they code? Hmm, good questions. Um, some do exactly. It depends. <laughs> uh, after a while, it's it's true for simple ideas. Well, I think TBD. I'm sure you will agree with me. Like, you you kind of know. Oh yeah, I will do that. And like, it's kind of in your head. But then if you did have done like, well, how, like that's a complex verb tense for me. If you take the time to write it down, you will see things that in your head you didn't see. Even with experience, still some kind of like, oh yeah, I didn't think about that. So writing down on paper really helps. And and I used to do a lot of uh, that's how I, I also I get cracking. They had like a board, so you could do that. Uh, if we go back here, I have a project where I started. Oh, it's, it's annoying. Okay, I will lower the sound of my mic, so it, I want to remove this sound. When I'm moving my mouse, because uh, do you hear the mouse? But I don't want to be too low, so let me know. So where is it now? Half. This it's still here, right? It's still here, or is it just me? Maybe it's just me. Let's put it back. One thing I could do is. Why it's so echoey? My mic is catching a bunch of stuff today. Uh, awesome. It always fascinates me because code looks like another language. It feels like magic watching code. <laughs> well, uh, it's not magic. With experience, at some point you uh, you figure it out. So you could have this. Um, I I like to draw and, and and design stuff. I think I have. I think. Where was it? I'm pretty sure I did, or maybe in media. I have a schema that I put here, with the classes. and tables and stuff. So I try to sometimes have diagram and things like that. But here for me right now, when I took that, like I had no idea how to do it. So uh, I took the pieces that look really hard for me with my skills or like practice, because even if I've been doing .NET for 20 years, I'm not coding every day. Uh, so now I'm getting a little bit more back into it. So I feel like rusty. So, you know, so sometimes like you just like, ah, I don't know how to do that. Like, or maybe you did code for a lot of time, but never use 
multi thread whatever you are doing it was always like single thread so now like the task need multi thread so you don't know and that's why i stream just to show that even if you have a lot of experience it's very possible that you don't know and like how do you search how do you learn that's why i'm doing this stream but not this stream but like that's why i stream That's cool, Sardi Dev. Awesome. So, yeah, that's cool. Okay, so we did the PR, I think. Did, it, did we? Yes, so it's here. So we have the PR file change was the the yam oh yeah yeah we changed because we oh i had the names i removed the password yep okay docker compose we removed the password config we added the creature that makes sense Hey, shy programmer. Hello, hello. Welcome to the stream. I'm I'm doing great. Thank you for asking. I hope you are doing great. How was your week? Or Friday? How was your week? My week was spent in biceps file. And I watched a little bit of one or two video. Or, yeah, one or two video about uh, the build that I missed. One this morning with Amanda Silver, and it was pretty cool. And uh, Shade Boy data. We had the new data schema. We had the table, Azure CLI. I'm not sure why we touched that. Docker Compose API. Nothing. Okay, cool. This looks good that looks good so let's let's merge it squash and merge why not boom boom excellent delete yes excellent so now we have creature so let's go back i think we had one more branch here oh no like we deleted it i oh, don't no, pick a door Pick a door. I'm not sure what's the difference. We could do this, we could do this, voila. There it is. So now we could delete. We could delete. Thing. Oh, right, that's cool. Learning some Python. Python is useful. Back yesterday, I was conflicted with, with that. I didn't know enough Python to validate something. And it was like, yeah, you can do it in Python. I was like, I don't know Python. So DAR are selectable. So let's compare those two. Uh, I think I had some, um, yeah, compare. Right. So let's just trying to see if, because let, let me explain what I'm trying to <laughs> messing around. Okay. So let's, I want to clean up my environment. So add the gaming, the gaming pad page. But this, see how it just like, and there, I wonder. Do we have that in main? That's what I want to know. 
I think we do. Yeah, I didn't have that. So let's open the code. I did control shift E and it will open VS code for me in the that specific project. And now I could go in the client here in the page. Uh, we have the play page, right? And if I go here in play, we were adding the dungeon map. So I think we have that. A bit big the tab map adventure yeah so we I have that yeah tab map so I did had the map so we have that select door in shared so if I go in shared I should have select door dialog so we have that so why did i not merge it that's weird shy programmer i'm already far in the course i'm learning about data now oh yeah that's nice the, the person in the guide is trying to teach Start of data science. Not sure how far it will go. So, well, Python is often used for that, in an I in IoT too. It's a uh, it's really uh, used in uh, data science. So, it makes sense that it goes that way. <laughs> I love data. I used to uh, to be DBA, so so I think I will keep the branch just in case. Can I put? What can I put? What? So we don't need that one though. That one was merge. Yeah, that one was merge. So we can delete that one. Oh, I can check. Pick a door. Is it still open on the? Uh, on the issue here. Yeah. It was it was closed. So why? Did I copy the code? 31 door. Yeah. Okay, anyway, so let's create a new, a new branch here and we'll call that combat, adding combat, combat page, combat screen, add combat screen, and you know what, no, I won't do that, instead I will go into I like to have the tracking. So let's create a new issue. Whoops. I want to create a new issue, please. I want to do uh, missing combat screen or encounter. I don't know how to spell that. Okay. Nobody uh, told me if you could hear my mouse. I'm guessing nobody cares, by the way. Um, so yeah, I'll create the new issue. Just catching up on the chat. I'm already, you know, because I read that. Yeah, I used Unity too. Hey, thank you for the follow, Top Wag Code. Thank you, thank you a lot. It's very appreciated. Very, very appreciated. Uh, Use Unity tool. Yeah, that's cool. 
That's a tool I never... Did I? I think I did install it after one of my colleagues, we did a stream and um, and uh, she showed me a lot about Unity and it was very tent and then, uh, uh, is it Lana? Lana was always streaming, doing a lot of Unity and stuff. At some point I was like, oh, I feel like I would like to do that, but I think the focus, <laughs> not too much enhancement. Uh, so that's why I didn't do it. But yeah, Unity is cool. So good, good choice. Uh, X I C X. Yeah, no problem. Uh, shy, shy programmer. Have a good weekend. Have a good day and happy weekend. Uh, let's add this to the project. Voila. Status will say in progress. Create a branch, yeah. I wonder if I do this, what will happen? Let's try that. Oh, it helps a little bit. Let's try this. Okay, cool. So like I have this, I have that. So the beauty, why the reason why I'm I'm doing that right now, creating a branch here is when I will merge or like had stuff or things like that, GitHub will track it. So so first and now like having it in the project. And I could say milestone, but like I said, I'm, I don't feel right now as like I'm building something right now. I'm just kind of validating how I will do things. Uh, so right now in the project, you can see now I have this card and like you can see here all the other suggestions. So at some point I will list everything I want in there and like really keep track of that. GitHub did improve a lot. The uh, boards i really miss the git kraken boards i wish it was still there i did try to use trello my wife just arrived at um I, tr I did try to use trello but i don't know are you is someone in the chat using trello let me know maybe it's me i don't know how trello works okay so Let's go back and get cracking. So the beauty of it now is see, I have this. So I can just double click and I have it. Yay, successfully. Oh, I'm hitting it. Hold on. Successfully put there. So now if we go in, the, I could have done it also here uh, in Git Lens. There's a lot happening. I need to use, I need to learn more how to use uh, Git Lens. Now the dog want to see the, the girlfriend. Oh, I don't want to see her. I don't want to go upstairs. Nope. Just stay with me. Okay. So. I guess we, st we start with adding a page. Do we call that encounter? It's not necessarily like I'm guessing it's a combat. I think I will go with combat. Yeah, let's do that. Add a new file. It will be a razor. Razor page. Razor page component. I think that one is a razor page. Razor page. And it will be called what? The file name. It will be called combat. Yeah. And why did you do that? Oh no, you didn't like separate. Why? Why do you do that? MVC? What? Really? Did I did I pick the wrong choices? 
let's go in the other corner so like you can see fully this let's delete that page again let's try to do it again maybe i did something wrong so i'm in page and let's say here i'm right clicking adding a new file yes and i'm by the way i'm in the uh forgot what it's called dev c sharp dev extension so like it should know so add new file so now i have class and then so maybe maybe razor component instead let's call it combat oh yeah Okay, so Razor Page is the version for the uh, MVC and Razor Component is come back. Okay, I didn't know what I was specific. See, we learn all the combats. Great, then we have code. And one thing we definitely need to do also in this project is upgrade the version of our... Uh, Where's the project of the uh, what? Oh, fluent, yeah, fluent UI. This one, I'm pretty sure there's a new uh, version of it. If I do this, I bring in this, can I? Uh, net less this. I think I need to do package, right? How do you how do you can you list? Because my reflex is usually to open the browser and just go there. Package. Maybe um it doesn't know this, so. Uh, Oh, I'm sorry again. Hiding the way. So if I do uh, dot net package and then dash dash. No. A search. So now, that's exactly what I was looking for. So component is now at, oh, look at that, 472 instead of 421. So I'll definitely go, ha, ah, whoops, 72. Icons, same thing. 7.2. That's great. I didn't use emoji in this project. Maybe I should. But no, not yet. Maybe I will do to have like a dead bone skull or something like that. Okay, so uh, let's. Do it again with the uh, quick grid. So I'm not using quick grid. I don't think I'm using quick grid anymore. Let's go with this one. I feel like it's always good to once in a while. Make sure you're using a recent version. So WebAssembly. WebAssembly server is now, what? Oh yeah, that's the one, seven. What? Okay, Docker set. Uh, WebAssembly 806. 
Okay. Boom. And then server, same thing. Great. So there's just now that quick grid, but I think I'm confusing it. Let's have a quick look. I don't think I need it. If I search for quick grid and fetch. Fetch data. Yeah, see, I commented it. Oh, here I'm using it. What's Aventure create? Am I still using it? I think I switch. The thing is, I switch. Yeah, I'm not using it. Yeah, I can remove that too. So I could remove this. And that was here. I could remove it. Uh, I so quick grid is a fantastic grid. Uh, it was added to Blazor in fall, I think. If Jeff was there, he will, he will tell me exactly when. Uh, it implements really good stuff. Uh, but since I'm using Fluent UI, they use quick grid so I, that's why I like I don't I don't need to reference that other one because I'm I'm referencing this one so we have this block so now if we try to build so let's clear and let's do a dot net build where I am I need to go in the uh source folder voila whoops <laughs> let's do a clear screen and do a dot net build a bunch of warning i need to work on my warnings too but office color does not contain the vision of oh they changed that check so to attribute value yeah it's there and and what's the Office color. Uh, okay, color, get the color. It's an office color. Value is supposed to be also not so. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do here. No, that that's not. Um, Office color does not contain the attribute. Okay. So why it was there? I feel like that's one of the change they did. So here it was, it was there, but office scholar doesn't have it. So I'm trying to get the color exodusma. So I'm guessing then I'm just doing OK, 
Okay. Okay, let's do this. Whoops, let's control Z. Then I'm gonna do office color. Let's let's Google it. Um, office color dot. How was it right? Oops. say it was in the fluent fluent ui blazer so i'm sure the guy did some ducks where can we find a variable color sync pass in blazer what's new in the yeah there it is yes i won't be able to do this one can i switch wham if I do this and open it to do this, I cannot, since I work at Microsoft, I cannot open the Microsoft because I often have a lot of access and it requires me to be on my work desktop. So that's why I switched to uh, invisible mode, just for that. So otherwise, it will try to get me sign in. And it will fail because this is my personal laptop. It's not my work laptop. Well, that's all. Yeah, that's the team, right? It's in the settings. I feel like jump trying to fix it without understanding what's happening. So here I have a color. The color is default. Default is zero. And now it's trying to set it to a color X. Color X is a string, I'm guessing. What are you? Oh, it doesn't know because, yeah. To attribute value. I don't understand what it means. Go in the ducks laser. Uh, fluent UI. Okay. So I think it's that one. Go a little bit smaller. They have a lot of duck. Let's go utility slack rich. Color now. See, they are using the teams. So let's go black. Icon button, checkbox, drop label. Uh, search field gallery picker. I don't think it's this item list. I don't think it's that command menu navigation. I don't think it's that notification. No progress. No surfaces. Maybe. I thought it was uh, utility. Uh, 
Let's see. Uh, I'm trying to fix a bug. I bump up my version and now it's complaining that uh, in Blazor WebAssembly, uh, the Blazor Fluent UI, the office color doesn't have this. So that was the code that was working in the previous version. Now they changed it. So I'm assuming this is not there. So I'm just trying to uh, to understand where it go, how to how to make the the code compile again. And here, why don't I see themes? So that's version eight. Wait, what? So they are using eight. So maybe we should still, maybe we should backtrack. And, and what's the version we're using? Eight. No. Yeah, Blazor. What? <laughs> Blazor Flint UI V8. But why do I have four here? Last. You don't code for like a month and this, and then uh, what's happening? Pack compile. Uh, okay, maybe I need to change. Maybe I shouldn't change yet. Yeah, maybe I shouldn't change yet so we could have some progress. I don't feel like it's a real problem. It's a real, real deaf problem to understand what's happening. So we have, so we have this. Maybe that's the same page. So I don't have so many do you understand what i mean tbd i think it will And, and, uh, the thing is like, it's like, what, where, wait, and settings. That's where I, I switched it to team for, for me, uh, in my code, I have dark and had different team, but here it says like office color doesn't have the two attribute value. But if I do this, I see that there is in fact one there. And it's accepting a string. So maybe I need to do this instead. Is it like how it's supposed to be working? And it says no. Does not contain the definition of two attribute value and not accessible extension. Accepting the first one of office column. Should be column. Oh, accent. Like, like something is wrong. Maybe my IntelliSense is not great. I mean, I could just like go back to where I was in the version and uh, understand better. Thing. 
because that was Vincent blog post. So, color is office. Yeah, color is off is a uh, is an inum. What? It's an inum of office colors. Color, yeah, it's an inum. So I don't understand. I don't even understand the code I did. My good wow, Frank. What's happening, Frank? So getting the current office color based on oh no yeah I could I cannot check this one um, I think I will revert back for now and I will check the the new version it's probably explaining one of their uh, update and I missed it and. I thought it was it was nice to go up. Yeah, so if we go here version of component is two one. Go back to two one then. Unfortunately for now. Temper. Just for now. Fluent. Uh, Two dot one. And you know what? To make sure we, I, when I say we, I mean I, don't forget about it. Let's go here and create an issue. Often a change we face when we do upgrade. Yeah, exactly. But that could be <laughs> that could be a topic for a stream. Hey, let's try to upgrade and see what breaks. Anyway, okay. So let's go back into the code. Let's see if I clean my whoop. If I clean the screen and try now. Let me build. Hopefully, it build. Cool. I know one stream will be let's remove all those warnings. Definitely working on that at some point. But yeah, I'm surprised uh, that uh, Vincent and uh, Denis. Uh, like it's that's why I'm saying like it's probably in their uh, docs or update. They, I know they both often, let's say, often share, they do a blog post when they upgrade the library. So, uh, great. Okay, so now we have a new page. Empty page. It's been a while since I code uh, with this. I don't remember, but we wanted some sections, right? Uh, and we should have a way to quickly get to this page. So let's go in our project. 
let's close this here. Let's go into Solution Explorer. So I think we need to go in the share and add in our nav menu. Um, add a page for combat. So we'll do this here. I should now close the. So here we'll go and we'll say come back. And uh, the page will be come back. And we need an icon. Regular app folder. Nah, we need some kind of like a sword or something like that. Did I close the. Uh... No, it's here. So let's go in icon. Where is it? Icon. It's so weird. Uh, we had some kind of search in there, you know? Does it look like... No. Wait, what? So a shield or a sword or an axe. Maybe there won't be any icons like that though. Before, should we add a, a way to filter? Like right now, I don't know why there's two lists. Okay, so battery, what? Battery, the little island, a bed. <laughs> I mean, we could use this, look like some kind of bow. <laughs> um, hmm. Something like this. I don't like it, but if we don't find anything. Uh, creature, so we like a bug. Maybe. Like if we need a store, see like there's a shield there. I could just have the shield. Pretty sure we had the way to... Uh... Let's try something. If I do this and I do shield. Scroll, 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 scroll. Now you saw everything. Shield. We see four now. No, it's like only with. Yeah, yeah shield, shield, shield. Uh, pretty sure there was something to filter a uh, sword. No one. Huh? And the next one. 
We had something better. Well, so it looks like the same, but I'm not sure why I see those two different, right? If I go at the beginning. Access time 24. And here, oh, I think it's just reverse. Okay, so they are the same. Uh, let's take the bug for now. And, uh, I would like it to look I wish I had something a little bit more. It is a corporate stuff. So oh oh backpack cross prison balloon But Maybe if we had like a screen with the shield, so it could be like the combat screen. Right? Did we have that? Like, you know, if it could be something like this, but instead be uh, with a shield. this but instead of screen not like a, a email Cloud, 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 Okay. Definitely corporate style icon. It makes sense. Field UI. Give me something. 
I would like to have a shield. Now we are in the sea. Maybe if I go and S. Well, that's see, that's not bad. Okay. So let's go. There it is. Shield. Cool. So we want a shield. How many minutes did we spend? <laughs> Fine. Yeah. And I can't. I don't know. Probably too much. <laughs> oh well, you know, priorities. Do I land? I don't think so. Oh. Yay! Yeah, I know. Eighty-one. That's amazing. What? It doesn't know about shield. Oh, S. Oh. This. Okay, so now we have a menu. So we'll land on the combat page. Now we want some kind of panel. So I think I don't remember how to do that. So what we could do is check other screen how we did it. So for example, the... Uh, Adventure create. Adventure picker. So I had a grid. I don't want to show a grid for this one. I want to show kind of like collapse. So how's the, the score for um, CB? Tell me. Am I leading? No, I think uh, Grobozorus was... I forgot who's leading. What was a risk lead to me? Yeah, so I just need to beat who's a risk. Uh, that maybe? So here have some stack. Could use that. Right? Okay, let's go dark mode here. So let's close, 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 close. So not basic control. This no. Is it surface? Surfaces? Panel. Ooh, panel is cool. That's not what I want. So I think it's in the... No. Basic control? Or gallery? No. Wow, where is it? Okay. Oh. No. Oh. No. Here? No. What the hell? 
What the? Document card. <laughs> I feel like it's not a list, it's panel. So I thought it would be. Oh, well, what, what I don't understand. Comment bar, it's not a comment bar. Context menu, it's not a context menu. Navigation, it's not navigation nav bar either. Oblo overflow, no overflow. That's not what I want either. Want to be at the end of it? Be Clovisaurus. Let's dial it. Jeff Sat is landing. It's not bad. Oh, look like I will just copy whatever code I had before. I'm disappointed though. Why? They feel like. Maru, hi. Ragbird is here. Maybe next time, Fragbird. How are you, my friend? Yeah, so that's not what I want. So that's a grid. <laughs> Deep. But I, I get it, right? You say, nah, I'm not lending. And then just one more time. So it's the accordion. I don't want accordion. Fluent stack. I think it's the, f I want some stack. But why did I see that on the other one? Okay, let's do this. So we'll do a fluent stack. What's happening? Hey, thank you for the follow. John and B. Raf. P.S. Thank you. Very appreciated. Welcome aboard. I'm doing okay. Try to do an ERL ride stream. It was bad. Oh, really? Three hours. I I think I did on my bike inside. I think the longest I did was an hour and a half. And I was bored. And like I had a good movie in front of me. <laughs> and I think it was mostly zone two. Like low zone two with some spikes. So we're talking uh, bikes, uh, Swift, oh. or I am like because he, Fragbird is doing some. Let me do a shout out. Shout out to. Sure, don't do any typo in your name. Fragbird, voila! Shout out to Fragbird. He's doing a uh, bike street, and you can see him suffer and sweating, and it's wonderful. <laughs> well, I why don't you go outside? 
anything over two hours under yeah definitely like you know if you have a good movie you could at some point kind of like but even like with the fan and anything it was i had two water bottles i, I was prepared but yeah no i did an hour and a half um, how long was my ride the other day but i was taking it slow i need to do an adjustment on my bike let me check I was I was happy. I did like the um I did the entire tour of uh the island where I live. Let's go bigger. Voila. And that was how long was it? It was just 32 kilometers, so not that big with 400 like close to 500 meters of uh the, um they say elevation gain but i'm assuming is how do you say that then the elevation they and well, how long did, did it take uh one hour, 38 minutes. Oh, 38 kilometers. Oh, 32, I said, right? Yeah, 32.23. That's... Uh... Yeah, 20. It was good. I was happy. I did try to do it the week before or two weeks prior to that. And my knees was like, nope, buddy. I don't want to, I don't want to complain today. I don't want to not, not complain, but I don't want to, I'm not happy. <laughs> Grumpy knees. So I was like, okay, let's do it shorter. I did some kayak and I'm not sure if this weekend I do bike or kayak. So we'll see. But I don't like so I just needed to like my wife has been telling me that. I think the entire winter. You need uh, to do an adjustment. Go and do an adjustment. Pay for it. Oh yeah. Food party. So orientation vertical. So if yeah, so if we go back to the book, we wanna had oh maybe we could add like our card, like our version of, of this on the the left, let's say. Then in the middle we put this one. Oh, I'm not sharing my screen. Okay, let's start over. So on the left we could put something like this like our version of it so we see like our what kind of weapon we have how many hit point and stuff not hit point but like a health point and stuff like that in the middle we put the this and maybe we could have like different tabs so you could go and check the quick reference if you need to and then on the right side we have that that could be cool I'll be making 40 pounds of Ooh, graduation party. Excellent. 40 pounds. <laughs> I have a barbecue, but I used it to do hamburgers, chickens, roll, roll, um, you say that like, um, chicken on a spike. I don't know how you say that. Vote poll. Oh, there's a poll. <laughs> Excellent. No, no coding. No coding. I think I think I, I'm really not sure. Like if I do kayak. Oh. 
Thanks for the uh, for the the vote. I never think about those things. Let me. Uh oh, wait a second. Oh, maybe I should. You know what? Let's open it in the uh, in incognito mode. Apps. Google.com. Oh, cool. So, this is my little island beside the big island of, of Montreal, but mine. It's not this is where I live. It's not mine. So, I did the tour of that in bike. I did the tour of this. So, like in the evening, start from here, and I did the tour of that. That's about like 45 minutes. Like in the evening, it's very easy to do. But I was thinking if I go and kayak, I could, there's a place, I think it's here. I forgot where it is. Yeah, here I think I can go start. So I could go here and then cross the the big Saint Lawrence River. So like here, there's Pagbo and stuff. But like I could cross this and come here. This is very beautiful. I go. Ah, uh, we won't see it correctly. But th there's islands there. They are nice. Could go there. Let's see. Like we we see a big Pagbo there. And like come here, come back there. Could do that. Yes, we can. Or, I don't know, or maybe around here, where is it? I've never been there. Let's put back the, uh, here it's called the uh, river, uh, river of Thousand Islands, because there's a lot of islands, as you can see. I've never been there, but there's a park. So I could I could park over there and like do kayak. I'm assuming by bike it should be super cool. And bike also I want to like do something like there's a road going up to the the north. There's so much stuff to do. That's the thing. I'm not sure. Times to figure out my butt bunk. Or what, Fragbird? Keep trying dropping. We need to to beat Grovosaurus. How to rig the poll? <laughs> oh, is it finished the poll? Oh, how can I show the result? Kayak one. How can I show the result of the poll? Two result. Show me. Here it is. Well, like, you know, we were three to vote. I'm assuming. Sorry, Dev, you, myself. <laughs> so we know who vote bike. <laughs> And I'm not sure. I will. I will let you know. But I'm happy that nobody say code. What the forecast is around. But no, I need. I need to do some cleaning if I'm stuck at home. What are like the weekend looks good. Like sun, 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 sun. It will be outside. It will be stuff outside. Okay. I know I'm doing kayak tonight, but it won't be like real, real adventure. My wife is uh, going for, a, she's training in free water, so I follow her, so she's swimming. So obviously she's going slower, right? Fred the cat landed, real shirley bot landed, cryptographer landed. But I didn't land and neither did, did Fragbird. It happens. Oh, now it's the real Shuri bot that is leading, though. Neverland. 
I should have, like, I, I will ask and stuff love to, like, create a new version for you. And it just, like, kind of follow you just to make sure that you land. And just when you're about to land, just like, weep. <laughs> just, you know, just, like, it's, it's always, like, so close. Okay. Oh, no, I closed the... Did I close it? Yes. Yeah. In the screen with the chat. Oh, because I see it there, but it's another computer, so I gotta type. Okay, so uh, we have this, and I said we were going horizontal, so we need to change this for horizontal. Voila, that's great. So now inside of, of this thing, we want to have... Oh, we have the uh, adventure card. I have an adventure card. But I need a player. Okay. Oh, that's the thing. Yeah, that's the thing. Prediction. You're having so much fun, Sharda. Can Fragbird land on the target in the drop game? He landed a few times. He landed a few times, but not now. Yeah, so now because it's a new page, we didn't have that. Right, because all the others, it was all like a component so maybe combat needs to be a component too so i could have parameter or have an adventure yeah i think i will do that right so <laughs> I'm so bad multitasking. I was typing exclamation point adventure. Feel good about it. But nope. Oh, uh, no. Undefined process, Lutlen. Popcorns dropping. Uh... All right, so when we are in play. Yeah, it will be in another. Do I need to pass the full adventure or just the player? I think we just need the player. Or do we need more? Adventure card. 
let's let's find let's create an adventurer just for for now so let's do adventurer we'll call it player for now player mm -hmm. do this for now I uh, will probably fail, right? Because I guess it will be okay. What are you complaining about? I thought that was part of my uh Oh, because I have the adventurer page. Uh, okay, and the class. Oh, okay, that's interesting. So I need to um, uh, if I do this. Let's solve the problem. To change those names. Preview is in fact a DTO. But I don't think I want to see preview, uh, adventure preview. Oh my god, I'm, I'm like, it's been too long. Adventure, I have a full adventure here. So namespace, oh game? So this should fix this one, it won't come. Oh, text bar. May only appear with a local variable. Okay, let's go then do game here. I could take this. This. No? do this I want to have a full name though can I do this oh I'm missing new 
Okay. Woo. All that for them. So I have a new adventurer. That's cool. Now we have this. Yay. Okay. So that's a horizontal. Now the next one. It will be a new component, and it will be the. Uh, what do we call that? Those. Those. So quick reference combat. Quick reference cards, like that. But we need combat. Quick reference, combat. Right? Though. be that and after that whoops oh we don't have a monster card so we need to create also a monster card right so after that the next one will be the creator card so we need a creature card right and we'll probably have to buy a bunch of stuff And here we'll probably have a status fight. I don't know. <laughs> hey, GT Sam. Like, drop? Oh, do I have those? I think I keep changing who I subscribe by month. So, is it Clarkio right now? Oh, so that's not Clarkio. It's, it's coming from. Uh, Singularity, right? But it's Clarkio's eyes, but it's Singularity. I have a uh, subscription of someone I don't know. Okay. Uh, okay. This won't look funny. She's crying. I was it is Clark Hill eyes, but I was wondering. Ah, uh, okay, okay. I thought for after a collab or something, Singularity was was using Clark Hill's eyes just for kind of a joke, just like for a long time on uh, Triple B, he had Bonjour High. Oh, Shirley Dev, that sounds pretty good. 97. Well done, mister. Yay! Well done. That's great. Wow. Do I have applause? I think if it's here. I forgot where it is. That was loud. <laughs> that was really, really loud. Uh, oh, hey, and I see the time is flying, and we are just getting into it. Ah, oh, that, that was... We're just getting started, though, because we had so many little glitchy things. Yeah, that's good. So we need... We need to... Um, we need the quick reference card, and we need this. So let's have some to-dos in our uh, board here. Binks. We'll do project. Oh, I had, I thought I had that open. Probably closed it at some point. 56. Surely Dev, just standing. Surly Dev, sorry, I'm always kind of like, 
Um, add an item. Okay. And what was the other one? We need a creature card. And we want something that look. Could I put an image? Those are not the um, the creature anyway. The creature will be yeah. Let, let's not put that for now. Ah, whoops. Like the games could be cool. Uh, I wish I could make. Can I make those like parents or childrens or? Move bottom column. I wish they, I could. I'll convert to an issue. to an issue I wish I could make them related if I go now to dungeon app oh, I mean project can you do that Like related to whatever, whatever. So related to 36. Let's do that. Boom, boom. Well, that's cool. So at least now we know. We we know where we're getting at, and we need to. I need to understand. Get back in my uh, fluent U, Blazer fluent UI game because it's a bit disappointing, you know. Like yeah. Well, that was that was pretty cool. I'm happy with my the the stream today. I think we did great. Um. So yeah, uh, any friends who saw screaming right now? Let's check. There's Triple B. Oh, there's uh, Lila. What's she doing? Accessibility, Blackboard, AI. That sounds, that sounds interesting. Not a chance. <laughs> I agree. No chance. Yeah. Okay. So let's uh, let's raid Lila. Like if I do this, will it will work? Is it working? Not sure. Oh no, it's slash. Raid. There it is. So, Cloudies, have a good weekend, and we'll see you next week. Bye-bye.